So, what do you think of that new opening on our videos? Isn't that great? We're really quite proud of it and how it relates to our business. We'd like you to leave your comments about that opening as well as like our channel and subscribe to our channel as well. Now to introduce this video, first it was taken at a practitioner's conference in Cheyenne, Wyoming on the weekend of May 1st and May 2nd, 2020. And it was held at Country Doctor Clinic and it was hosted by Dan Young. Personally, I held three different classes at that conference, all dealing with red light therapy. In this case, we're dealing with the benefits of using red light therapy with people. And the response was so good, and there were so many questions that really tested my teaching ability as well as my knowledge of red light therapy. So enjoy the video and be aware that red light therapy is beneficial for both horses and their owners. Enjoy. Thanks for coming by. We start from the upper point of the cheekbones, right here, number one, on both sides, okay? Um, number two is it has an arm, but the, the bend in the arm, you start to see the fold, it's right there, okay? Uh, third point is actually uh, on the outside web, by both thumbs, okay? Fourth is like we was doing her, right up on the side, the base of the, the neck. Uh, five is down in the areas of kidneys. Uh, six point is on the outside of each calf, the fattest point of the calf. And again, the seventh is down in between, the, right behind the ankle. Okay. And you do each point no more than two minutes? No, you even don't even need to do one minute each or 30 seconds each. Um, as far as ages, using, you know, with, with laser, uh, light therapy can be used on infants, it can be used on people older than us. <laughs> okay, uh, it doesn't matter age, there's no restriction. Uh, the basic limitations are you're just dealing with at certain times, uh, certain pregnancies. Okay, and not all pregnancies at that, so. Um, the, the biggest thing we've found is the acceptability once people really feel what it does for them. That, you know, it's not a cure-all, but it is a, a bullet in their own arsenal to help them feel better. Arthritic people get a lot of uh, comfort out of these things. Even older people that have bad knees and bad elbows and, and even arthritis in the knuckles and different joints in the hand. Um, got one lady who's bought a set for herself and then a set for her mother and her mother's just like well, her mother's in her 80s and she says she's getting around so much better now mm -hmm. so but works very well with arthritis yeah and uh, that's where it's just going thank you sir the blue light has been used extensively in dermatology uh acceptability in both uh standard medic medicine uh and uh you know alternative medicine has become more and more very well accepted in the uh, veterinary field and all fields have, have really taken hold of this when it first started in the 60s, 1960s. Um, the biggest thing that the dermatologists are using it for, they'll take the blue light and it actually, the blue light set at the frequency will kill the, the DNA in acne. And so then when they kill the acne, again, it doesn't take that long, it takes only less than two minutes to to do the acne treatment, then they come in with the red light afterwards to close up the pores. And uh, that has really gotten a lot of acceptability uh, in, in dermatology. Now there was an article I found just before we came, it was, it's dated the 27th of April of this year. And it's written by a lady who actually uh, worked with board certified dermatologists and other medical professionals. And it explains you know, what they do as far as the acceptability. And I printed it out for you guys, basically because it will give you some real good ammunition with anybody that says that uh, you know it's, it's not a quality uh, treatment. It does show that it's accepted by standard medicine and, and as well as by alternative medicine. And it's a field that's growing very quickly.